Okay, we're back, and hmm, how can I resize this? Uh, let's flip it over here. Hold on a second. Ah, I have extra space at the side, so... Right. Um, I think this is going to be about the best view. I have notes for myself to try to do better. I've not been doing well recently. Um, some of that is surely because I, uh, well, there's lots of reasons, but some of it is surely because I've had a bunch of stuff going on recently, life-wise, um, crazy couple weeks. But should be on the downswing with that, and uh, going to try to get refocused here. Um, so, what are my opening things? Read every card on the board. Sea Hag, good. Counterfeit, good. Mandarin, mediocre, and probably not doing so much here, I think. Uh, Rabble's good for an engine. Trading Post is maybe good, but I think it's going to get outclassed here. Rats is most certainly going to get outclassed here. Sort of works well with Trading Post. Money Lender probably getting outclassed here. Mining Village could be important for an engine. Steward is a bomby good card. And Poor House could be very good for... Could be very good for um, moneyless engines. So, looking for new interactions... that I haven't considered yet. Um, okay. Um, I don't think there's much in the way there. Mandarin, get your counterfeit back. Nah. Money lender goes well with poor house, of course. Um, rats counter sea hag somewhat. Yeah, I don't. I don't think plausible strategies. Well, there's sea hag, which I think I want to skip. I think it's going to be. You could go for sea hag and counterfeit and rats, but the sea hag is strong enough cursing. Plus, this is pretty strong for an engine. It's got to be an engine. So, how are they going to work tactically? Got to think about that. Calculating. Okay. So I want to open Steward, Trash Down, get a Mining Village engine going. The question is, do we want to go for Poor Houses or something more like Counterfeits? And I think because I'm going to be a little bit limited on Villages and because um, Counterfeit's the only way to get plus buy, that I'd prefer to go for Counterfeit, I think. So that's the way I want to go. Um, unfortunately, I can't figure out how to keep this up. 
while clicking in, and he goes for money lenders. So what does that mean? See, general, watch opponent, keep track of cards, focus. So you got a money lender. What does he want to do with money lender? I don't know. Um, and I have a decision here. Do I want to get a second steward? Or I think the other option would be Sea Hag. I'm a big fan of double steward openings. And I think that's how I want to go here. This is a point where I should really focus and try to bleed out. He's gone money lender, which means he'll only have one steward. Sea Hag probably should be pretty good. I guess I'll go with Sea Hag. This is not what I want to see. Um, poor house, I think it'd be too many terminals at this point. And I don't like that this missed the shuffle. What is he going for? So he's not cursing me. He's gone for a village. Okay. So, a uh, second steward or a mining, I think I gotta go for a mining village here. Three terminals is too many. Lovely. Uh, I gotta prioritize trashing over the cursing. Okay. He has two, so he's going for this poor house deck. Okay. Now I'm definitely getting my second steward. And I think at this point, I wish I would have gone for just skipping the Sea Hag. Um, okay, that's probably about the only trashing I'm going to be doing for a while. Uh, with the steward, that is. Um... I may end up needing a counterfeit for more poor houses and just taking a hit on my poor houses. Going that way. Okay, I should be keeping better focus on... I've trashed two estates. He's trashed the curse in two estates. And I've trashed twice, so I've trashed two coppers. Which means I have five coppers left. That can't be right. I must have trashed... I've trashed three estates and three coppers. I've trashed three times. I believe that's correct. Which means he's trashed one estate, one curse, and four coppers. Uh, which means my sea hag isn't worthless here. Oh, I can't. And he goes for a province already. Okay. I don't think that's a good call. I'm going to sea hag. I'm going to take our coins. We're going to get the counterfeit. We want to get more mining villages and rabbles up. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure I want to take coins and coins here, because there's a sea hag here. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight. You can get me two villages. I think that's the way I want to go. Um, a second counterfeit. The problem with getting the second counterfeit is I may really want the plus buys, but I am going to have this issue with um, I am going to have an issue with poor houses not being so good. I guess I'm just going to have to deal with that. Um, I need a little more cash here. More villages don't hurt. I want to pick up rabble. I'm going to want to get money. 
So he has four, can't get to eight. Yeah, okay. Right, draw. Probably this was a loose extra village. Okay, so this is three, four, five, six, seven. This could get eight or nine if I go for the silver, but I think I should just get eight. Pick up a rabble and a silver. And I do need more cash. This is just four. Okay. Um, what is my last card? It's another village or a copper? Anyway, not something I want to waste the draw on. I think it's the other village, right? Okay, we're going to have 8, 9, 10. Uh, so 11 or 12. Um, definitely need another counterfeit here. And probably a gold, 11. Just try to build up this way. The counterfeit, why did I want it? Well, it's for the buys mostly. We'll probably want to pick up another village here and another rabble soon and then go for it. But I feel pretty good about my situation. Okay, let's draw. Take this for coins, play this. Um, this is 2, 5, 7, 9, 10, 11. I want village and rabble and Take coppers, I guess. Because I don't really want to get rid of this cash at this point, so. Rabble, village, and a copper for a little bit of extra cash. Okay, piles. Um, how many. Okay, what's been trashed? So he's trashed all of his coppers. He has a bunch of mining villages. He's trashed. He has two estate, uh, two curses. Excuse me. And okay, so he has no curses left now. But he does still have that province, which I can probably nail. Um, what is my last card here? Uh, it's another village, right? Okay. So, coins, coins, we hag him. Um, four, seven, nine, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. This is going to be at least fifteen. Um, I think I want another rabble. A province. And I guess that's it. Replace the copper or no? Um, yeah, I guess so. because I think I'm drawing enough that that's worth it. Trash is the second steward, okay. And yeah, so he can play one poor house, but it, his deck is reliant on getting mining village, poor house, poor house, and that's going to be pretty tough for him, I think. Keep, because I don't want to just end the game right yet. Keep... Keep rabble. 
keep keep rabble coins coins hag okay this is four eight twelve so thirteen fourteen um this is gonna get me to fifteen at least and I think we're gonna grab another gold yeah I think that's the way to do it province gold and copper and then I can start chewing through my silvers um, I think my deck is good enough to most turns still be able to draw it I have a pretty significant lead only three buys a turn means three pile ending is not very likely um, but I've got at least a potential lead with the curses um, okay he gets rid of that he gets double poor house here well now I could potentially end it in a turn or two okay but I don't think I want to quite go for that yet um wait a minute if I counterfeit this counterfeit this will give me this is a second buy this will give me third and a fourth buy and I get the poor houses and the curse and I win right let's double check that one buy two buys if I play this twice it'll give me three four buys I have enough money right two three yes okay all right um so I kept in my uh, plan pretty well. Forgot to check this mid to end game thing, but I played those fine anyway, I think. Um, yeah, so it's pretty good, at least for a bit of a longer game, but hopefully that's not too much of a problem for you guys. And uh, thanks for watching.